your person was honest what will be their confession towards you like you know if we talk to your higher higher self of your ex what will they confess to you right now let us see but again it's a collective reading take what resonates leave what doesn't um if it resonates with you if you feel like this is how my person talks or you feel yourself like that this might be your reading if not this is not your reading um and if you want to book a paid private reading you mail me at divine mother's guidance at gmail.com scammer steal my video and make fake profile here and there only account i have divine mother's guidance with 130k plus followers in tiktok and uh in instagram divine mother's guidance with 3900 plus followers my only youtube channel let's us tarot please subscribe to my youtube channel to support your daily thank you so much okay what's the first cards coming up habit i don't know if we will ever change what is this habit all about forgiveness i'm struggling to get over the past okay so this person feeling like something you have done they are not being able to forgive you for that all right and that's talking about habit so we don't know if we still get over this change what i'm getting like you reacted to certain things which this person found that it was a extreme reaction and they didn't expect that particular reaction of over what you they said okay this might be a very specific reading it might not be for everyone i'm feeling like they did something as per them it was very normal they didn't do anything wrong but you reacted to that and you said something to them they are not being able to forgive you for that and i believe i'm also getting that this person might be st they struggle with some kind of emotional regulation so they might not let go very easily so if you do something to them they will not forgive you very easily okay what else damage we both are hurting from this so also if this is a this is also a fact both of you are hurting for this the damage is being caused to both of you but both of you are not being able to come forward but it looks like both of you are very strong having strong ego at least this person feels that way reciprocity i don't want to have equal i want to have equal give and take so this person there might be a lot of differences between you cultural religious racial differences um they they, this person feels like this there is no equal reciprocation in this connection whichever way it is it can be that they do more or he did you do less or he, they feel that way or maybe you do more they do less and that's the fight in this relationship so this person is now realizing i definitely want to have an equal give and take in this relationship even though they are angry with you they are feeling that way what is this one holding back i should have expressed myself better okay that can be another fact that this person was not expressing themselves better so you misunderstood them and they you know they you you got triggered and you express your anger in a such a way which this person didn't really like but now this person is realizing that it is being damaging both of us and probably i didn't reciprocate equally or maybe i was holding back too much that's why probably you didn't understand me in a correct way okay what are you going to do guilty i feel pain from the damage i have caused okay they feel guilt about it but still they cannot forgive you so it's like a person who is they understand they're wrong but rather than rather than working on that they also been saying that i still remember how react you reacted means i am wrong that's okay but you are also wrong that kind of energy okay very good in gaslighting okay unexpected outcome thing didn't go the way i planned so i think the way they did it the way they were trying to pretend something or present something it go went completely wrong there was something maybe also in some cases they were hiding something you picked it up and you started fighting that can be also the thing or maybe they wanted to surprise you with something you didn't take it the way it was it can be also possible they acted in a part particular way and they found that you will be okay with that but you were not okay with that reveal i want to tell you the truth so it can be something they did hide from you so they want to tell you the truth right now hope i have not given up on us so they still hope that there is a uh, hope in this connection conversation i want to call you and hear your voice they want to talk to you and they will want, even though they are angry they want to talk to you and fix these things out and satisfied i was not happy the way things were going okay they are blaming you big time i think the way you reacted they didn't like it okay very good in gaslighting detachment i had to let this go so that i can clear my mind so our uh, bottom of the deck is mistakes i wish i could right my wrongs okay very clear this person made mistakes they understood that but still they are very master manipulator in time in case of gaslighting they 
sorry so they are still blaming you for whatever you have done rather than working on themselves and rather than focusing on themselves they are they know that they made a mistake they want to fix it they want to convert want a conversation with you but they are still blaming you so this is the person you are dealing with okay um so you know what is what is the deal but one thing i will tell you if you are dealing with this person and if something really happened rather than all the time blaming them focus on yourself right now see what you could have done differently if there is something you that you got really triggered that you could have worked because we always blame the other people that's the way this person is doing but you know we don't look into ourselves why we got triggered so go back to the incident that happened was it something really that you reacted the way was it necessary or you could have differently reacted or maybe that's something you could have done differently or maybe it is something that you also got to learn to take accountability about and uh, definitely on the same time put yourself on pedestal because i always want to tell you one thing no matter what the other people do you should be your top priority you should be loving yourself first It doesn't really mean that loving yourself self love doesn't really mean that you will be selfish at the same time but at the same time it's not that sacrificing your your own happiness for making other people happy so whatever happened make sure that you 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 clear your part you learn from your if you made any mistake or not make sure that everything was clear if you know that i didn't do anything wrong i was perfectly all right then start focusing on your life because if this person's tendency is like that because i'm pulling the collective energy right so it can be that really this person is um, you make some mistake in some cases in some cases maybe this person is solely responsible for whatever happened if that is the case understand what is this person they are gaslighting you they make the mistake but they are trying to blame you this is not good at all so in that case you start detaching yourself and focusing your on your life and move on with your life let them deal with their own shit and you know heal themselves because they need to learn to take the accountability of their own action that every action has a reaction so they need to understand that so given at that point i would say that take care of yourself love yourself do not now rush back to this person just keep doing whatever you are doing and love yourself